Hi guys, welcome to Simply Scuba. Here we have the Cressy Scorpion BCD. So this is a, a wing style BCD, so all of the inflation is behind you. Um, but uh, so the clever little change is you've got lots of buoyancy down towards your hips, uh, which is where you kind of want it to stay in that horizontal position, have a nice trim. You can really see that when I, uh, when I turn it around. Um, lots of padding, so it's nice and comfortable. So this is great for your traveling diver. You're just wearing a rash vest. Um, your straps aren't gonna be digging in and it's gonna be nice and comfortable. You do have pockets on this. So a lot of these sort of wing style travel type BCDs, um, they don't tend to have pockets. So you're limited on your storage, but this one does. Uh, you've got integrated weights and this is the kind of modern integrated weights which kind of sit behind you and kind of drop straight down instead of here in front. Um, so yeah, let's take a closer look. So starting up over your left hand shoulder, taking a look at the inflator. So the inflator hose, you've got the little section of Velcro to keep that in position. Um, following that down, that goes down to our inflator. So you've got the black button to inflate, the gray button to deflate, and you've got the oral inflation valve as well. Uh, if you grab hold of the whole thing and then pull that down from over your shoulder, that's gonna vent the, uh, the bladder as well. So that's really handy when you're on the surface, when you wanna get down really quick, just yank on that and you'll descend really, really quickly. Uh, underneath that, we got this kind of daisy chain style webbing. Um, so these can act as little uh, attachment points. So you can clip things off onto that. Uh, but you've also got big old D-ring as well. Uh, Pre-bent as well, which means that it always lifts away from the strap. So it's really easy to clip off onto it. Uh, across your chest, you've got a chest strap. So that's got two-way adjustments. You can adjust it on both sides, pinch clip in the middle. But what you can do as well is you can move that up and down depending on where you prefer it, or you can just remove it altogether uh, if you don't really like chest straps. Chest straps are particularly useful. So uh, it just holds those shoulder straps, stops them from pulling over your shoulders. Uh, over on the right hand side, much the same with the, uh, so the daisy chain and the pre-bent metal D-ring, except this time we have a deflation uh, sort of dump valve. Just pull on that and that's gonna dump the valve over your right hand shoulder. Again, a nice way to uh, sort of quickly get under the water. So adjusting those two shoulder straps, big old pinch clips, very easy to use, and uh, sort of big tabs underneath that to, uh, to loosen it off. And then that goes down to the pockets. So on either side, you can see these big square sections. So these are your pockets. You've got a, a metal D-ring on the top of that, just a small one, so that's handy for your gauges or something. Um, on the other side, you've got one with a, a little hose uh, sort of routing clip. So that's useful for your sort of octos or whatnot. Just helps you uh, sort of organize your hoses. But in the pockets, we've got big old zipper, and then that kind of bellows out a little bit. Not massive pockets, but big enough to put a, a finger spool or something inside of it. And you can put your uh, DSMB on the other side. Um, decent sized pockets, uh, especially for a, a wing style BCD that doesn't typically usually have them. Behind that, if you can see, so this is where our integrated weight system sits. So now they're vertical instead of horizontal. They don't sit here anymore. They're gonna sit round behind you. So that keeps them nice and close to your body. So you're still nice and trim, but grab hold of this black handle, yank it down, and that will allow you to, uh, to ditch it. Underneath that, um, you don't have any D-rings to lower down but you do have one that attaches onto your uh, sort of waistband, so that's gonna help you sort of adjust it. It's kind of held in position in this little clip, just keeps it nice and streamlined, so even when you're done up, uh, you don't have lots of this uh, kind of strap just kind of flapping around. Uh, same thing on the, uh, on the right hand side, same size pocket, uh, except yeah, you do get a little uh, sort of hose routing tool there. Now, on the side of the wings, you'll notice it's got this uh, sort of bungee cable system. So this just means, so right now it's fully inflated. Uh, we've got this tough reinforced section in there. So if you're going in and out of wrecks, even if you do bump up against something, it's less likely to uh, sort of rip and tear that material. Uh, but this bungee, if you do deflate it, you'll notice it starts to contract the wing and it kind of sort of wraps itself up in itself. So um, even when you're sort of not fully inflated, it keeps it sort of wrapped up nice and neat and tidy. So you don't have all this kind of loose material flapping around, creating drag and sort of getting snagged. 
So turning the BCD around, we see the uh, the shape of the wing. So little inflation up around uh, sort of your shoulders. Most of it is down here, um, sort of down your sides, either side of the cylinder and down towards your hips. So that's gonna hold you in a nice position underwater because most of the buoyancy kind of lifts your backside up so you stay nice and uh, horizontal. Now there's no um, sort of real solid um, sort of back plate to this. There is a bit of rigidity sort of in there behind this section, um, but it is quite flexible. Um, you have a little uh, sort of leash up around the top, so that can go around your cylinder valve, um, or it acts more as a, a sort of a grab handle. It's not the longest to sort of fit over a cylinder valve, so I just kind of use it as a grab handle, to be honest. Um, down below that, we have our cam bands, traditional plastic cam bands. Uh, sort of wraps around your cylinder and does the job. You've got a bit of um, that sort of plastic rubbery material, just acts as a bit of grip, but the kind of shape of the wing itself is naturally gonna cradle that cylinder and kind of stop it from twisting and turning. So down on the uh, on your right hand hip, you've got another uh, sort of dump valve. It's kind of held in position by this section of Velcro, uh, but you can take that off if you want. And this little dump valve, when you're inverted or horizontal, you can just pull on that just to uh, dump some gas. It's also an overpressure valve, um, so you can't over inflate your BCD. So all in all, a well together, uh, sort of well put together little um, BCD. As far as weight, it's very light. Uh, this is the size small, but uh, even if you go up sizes, uh, it's not a heavy BCD. Um, the material itself is kind of tough. It's not the toughest, but it is pretty tough, especially for a BCD that weighs this much. You've got everything that you need. You've got integrated weights as well. And because it's that uh, sort of wing style, even when you're fully inflated on the surface, it's not going to uh, sort of inflate and kind of take your breath away. Um, it, it, it's all behind you. So very, very sort of free feeling whilst you're in the water. I really like it. This is the Cressy Scorpion BCD. Thanks for watching and safe diving. We are an online dive store serving the UK and the world for all your diving equipment needs. So why not visit us at simplyscuba.com or click the box on your screen.